case you guys are wondering, today is National Piercing Day. And although we won't be getting anything pierced on today's show, no. my nieces actually, two of them, were so excited. They got their ears pierced a few months ago. And uh, they, they were champs, you know? They really were so like pain-free Did you catch it. it on video? We caught it on video, and we're about to roll the tape. Let's take a look. I think they're awesome. Yeah. Oh, they're so pretty. They're blue crystal ice crystals. They were begging for months and months and months, so we finally took them, and they were they were total stars. About oh, Ella so happy! I got mine pierced for my 13th birthday. Oh, you did? Yeah. Very nice. I got mine you pierced. Know, not too for long my ago. 25th birthday. <laughs> All right, folks. From funny animal videos to a childhood favorite that is making a return, now it is time to chat about what's buzzing on the web. Here to get the party started is the guy you hear weekday mornings during the Breakfast Club. It's 90 93 seven. The Beats. Marcus Sullivan, aka Memphis. Hey, Memphis. What's happening? How hey, you, you got your Stroh's yes. jersey on. I like it. One team in the league. Yes, there you are. They did this well. They went to the World Series. They didn't win, <gasps> but they went to the World Series. So. Well, maybe this time they'll win the World Series. Gotta give them some good luck, right? <laughs> yeah, you do. Absolutely. So what do you have for us today? We saw before the break mm -hmm. that very cute video of the raccoons. You thought that was cute. Oh, what? Right. That, <laughs> hey, hey, number three, <laughs> the cute raccoons. <laughs> yeah, they're very... The raccoons cute. They're you don't think it's cute? cute? Well, every time I see a raccoon, it's hanging out at a gas station and they're see they're, they're hanging outside of the gas station and they're waiting on you to get gas late at night and then they got the black gloves and their masks they look like they're about to steal something <laughs> right so instead of breaking into your trash can to steal your food, these guys are actually, I guess it was their owner who was blowing these bubbles. He clearly has pet raccoons. Right, that's what I thought. Yeah, that's... And hot. then they're trained. They're having so much fun. So I guess it is a cute raccoon video. It's okay. pretty cute. It is cute. It's, it okay. has a ton of views online, too. Yes, right. it does. Okay, so let's move on to trending topic number two. Yeah, number two. We can keep it pet friendly, right? Um, a dog gets jealous of a baby. Every that time, happens yeah. sometimes. I actually have a dog. He sits on my lap and never lets me get to my son. So check this one out. <laughs> oh, Every wow. time she tries to reach for the baby, <laughs> the dog has a little fit. Oh, oh wow. Now, really? that's oh, a cute video, dog. right? I mean, that dog is just holding on like, no, 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 I'm here too. He's grabbing <laughs> Her arm <laughs> oh, his back he as if he you. were the baby. He's See, like, your, I was the first baby. Your pets are family members, yes. too, and they get jealous. So you got to show the dog some love as well, right? Now, this video has uh, awesome. over half a million views right. online, and right. I can see why. It's very, very viral, cute. Right? All right. Trending topic number three. Um, the number one thing going on, and then I talked to the producer off the screen. She loved the video. Mr. Rogers' Neighborhood. Hey, oh. it's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Guys, I watch this show every single day when I was a kid. You did not wear your cardigan my today. Typical sweater. Oh, look at that opening. I mean, I remember this so well. <gasps> they are doing a marathon. It's going to be 18 hours, no, 18 days of oh Mr. Goodness. Rogers' Neighborhood. Well, yeah, we can see right there on the screen, 886 episodes in total. So that's going to take them nearly a month to get through I'm all wondering, those. growing up, how many of those episodes I actually saw. So it would be good to go binge watch that over the weekend, right? Oh, I love it. I mean, it's Mr. Rogers, you yeah. know? And in case you're wondering, this marathon is airing on Amazon Twitch. Um, I wonder how he got my sweater. I still don't, <laughs> I still don't get it. Here's a, here's a cool thing. It is raising money for PBS. Yeah. So that's really, yeah. really cool. And we all grew up with PBS. So, yeah. yeah. Very nice. Bring topic. back the Saturday morning cartoons as well, right? Yeah. Mm. Okay, I'm guys. So now it's time that. for the question of the day. Jennifer Broom. Do you know what our question of the day is today? Our question of the day is, what is your favorite family vacation memory? Mm. Dun, dun, dun. So we asked people in the mall. Here's what they had to say. Disney. <laughs> Definitely Disney World. We took a vacation to Walt Disney. My wife surprised me, and uh, it, was, it was the best. Uh, when, we got, when I actually got to Walt Disney, uh, I found that my, my parents were there, and all of my family was there. It was really cool. My kids enjoy and... It's kind of like getting out of your regular life. The kids love it. It's just an amazing place. The rides are phenomenal. We're going back. We took our kids to the Grand Canyon last summer, and um, it was great. Saw the sunrise, saw the sunset the same day. It was beautiful. My favorite family vacation is going to Bolivar as a kid. Why? Uh, just spending time with family, uh, being together, creating memories. Oh, we love going to Galveston. 
and we just sit out in the beach with the kids for summer break, you know, so the whole family goes and we just hang out out there. Hmm, Memphis, uh, what about you? She said Gal I, the Galveston water is amazing, right? <laughs> Hey, we're gonna a, be but do you have a favorite family days. vacation? Yeah, I do. Um, we went to uh, Legoland, which is in Orlando. So cool. almost, yeah, so we did that. And me growing up playing with Legos the whole time. So I thought that was awesome. Well, Memphis, thank you so much for stopping by. And, folks, you can check him out on the radios weekday mornings from 6 to 10 a.m. on 93.7. The Beat. Have fun on vacation, dude. Yeah. And speaking of family.